Note, this image could easily be a Photoshop image. So here's the image I found. I came across it, you know, a few hours ago, but I, said, I was looking for something to talk about Smash Bros. Here's a supposed leaked image that Kingdom Hearts is the next DLC character. First of all, this logo actually does look like the Kingdom Hearts logo. It does, actually. It's the actual Kingdom Hearts logo. So, what do you think? It's, I think this week... Mmm, I don't know if this is real or fake, you know. It's kind of hard to tell because it's just the Kingdom Hearts logo. They could have, you know... Thing is, first of all, it's very easy to Photoshop stuff just these days. It's very easy to change the color of stuff. You know, it's very easy to make fake reads. I won't be surprised if it's made by a Sora fan and say, Oh, Sora is coming as the next DLC character, okay? You know, this character... Sora is one of the actually, you know... To my surprise, is one of the most requested characters. I thought, you know, considering it's Disney, people say, Oh, I'm gonna shy away from... Having Sora wanted Sora and Smash Bros, because I know it's, the, you know, it's owned by Disney, why would you want? And Sora, even though Sora is, does not break the so-called rules of Smash Bros, because he is a video game character, he has, he's not a non-video game character, so I guess Sora can actually be in Smash Bros, because he doesn't really technically break the rules of Smash Bros. You know, I get, you know, I could say, you know, there have been other game, fighting games that have included non-fighting, you know, video game characters in the past. But it's up to Nintendo if they really want to do that, like, you know, Soul Calibur does, and, you know, Mortal Kombat does that as well. Well, you know, they have these non video game characters, like, for example, I think it was Soul Calibur 4, the, four they had Darth Vader and, and Yoda and as characters in the games, okay? Or Mortal Kombat, they had, like, a bunch of horror villains as some of the characters. But I think, you know, Nintendo's not going to put non video game characters in Smash Bros. for simple reasons. They, to, they want to keep it with only video game characters. It makes more sense, you know. Considering that the Smash community is very different from the Mortal Kombat community and, of course, you know, the Soul Calibur community. Well, they're going to be expecting at least one or two guest fighters. They're going to be, you know. And, of course, especially Soul Calibur World are owned by Warner Brothers as well, so... I think, you know, and of course, you know, they're owned by a movie company, Warner Brothers, you know, who is owned by Time Warner, who is owned by at and it's very complex, but that's how it is. And of course, all those characters were owned by Warner Brothers that were actually made in Mortal Kombat. So, now let's get back to Sora. So, Sora is a Disney character, okay? And, you know, by, you know, also a Square Enix character. It's one of those, Sora is one of those weird characters where there's no, no one, it's kind of split between two companies. You know, they have to get Disney's permission because Disney does own parts of the Kingdom Hearts franchise, okay, you know. To, of course, if they want to put Mickey and Sat and those characters as spirits, it's probably Disney music. Probably, and of course, they, and of course, here they have 11 songs from Kingdom Hearts and 19, is that, not, is that minutes or hours? Is it 19 minutes of music. So, what do you think of this week? I, you know, and also someone told me in the other video that, oh, that, um, Xeno Saga has a lot of symbolisms of, you know, God and stuff, which, now it kind of makes more sense that symbolism, that picture is a cross for the Xeno Saga one, now I know why, I, that's what I said, I don't know anything about Xeno Saga, so someone told me, probably said, who probably played the game, or obviously played the games, knows what the games are about, you know, told me what they're about, because I don't know anything about Xeno Saga, so I said, oh, you know, why is it a cross? Because I didn't know a single thing about Xeno Saga, so I'm not, you know, Cause I don't, cause I don't have that original game, so, so Kingdom Hearts could it be a possibility. Um, no, I don't think it's be the fifth, specifically the fifth DLC character. So has been deconfirmed by multiple reliable sources in the past months. So so is this week. I think it's fake. So so is not the fifth DLC character, like for the fifth time. Goodbye.